Oh, has this been the easiest week of your life on the bicycle? <laughs> um, no. Welcome to Race TV. And we are watching Race TV. What's the name in English? A whistle. A whistle. And uh, what are these whistles for? I use it uh, if somebody attacks in the band, then uh, I use it so I can make follow. <laughs> you can I think maybe they gave it to us because we lost the rider and couldn't find her in the ditch yesterday. <laughs> for safety. Water. Mix. And uh, super mix. I understand if you have a little bit the feeling from yesterday that for this specific stage we maybe lost our purpose a little bit but I, I don't believe it's the time to just go in the corner and sit and cry or go out there and try to do nothing. I think a day like today when we know from the beginning it will be really difficult for us but if we do it I think it will tell a lot about you as individuals also as teammates and also believe it tells a lot about you as a team, as a group, what you're able to do together. Also when it's not that easy, but that is really where you need each other, I believe. So please also have that respect for each other to do that, it's 90 case, tomorrow is tomorrow. But also have the respect for the race as well, it's a big thing being here, so we cannot allow ourselves to give up too early. Who from our team today will be the first to finish? Alison. She will sprint at the top. Depends on how many cheeseburgers I get. Actually, and it depends on how much mustard ketchup ratio also. I think Catherine. I think that's it, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you have a lot of trust in me. We should all finish together like in a line. Yeah. Ready to go? Ready to hit these mountains? As one of the most influential public figures in cycling, people are always asking me, Allison, how do you look so fly? Well, I don't go anywhere without my POC ventral helmet. Perfect for the peloton to the pool or everything in between. I'll take a ventral light. How's this for? What do you have to say about the POC helmet? It's like, oh, and I hope someone doesn't run out in front of me right now because you, you just could hardly see it in front of you. Super cool though, like all the fans are just so excited and just so into it. Fans were next level. The fans are so amazing and honestly it just like gives me so much energy when people are cheering for me. <laughs> And I had a, uh, a chocolate donut ready for you, but unfortunately I missed you. I'm so sorry. Maybe next time. Alison, sorry for eating a cheeseburger back back then, but we're rooting for you. Woo! Okay, it was right? delicious. Oh, that was so long. <laughs> we fight it at the beginning. We tried some stuff. So yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, just like. I tried to race as hard as we could and nothing to lose today, so just tried to have a little bit of fun and type two fun, I guess. <laughs> Congratulations! You have arrived at the Tourmalet. I have to ask a million dollar question. Did you get your cheeseburger? <laughs> there were three on on course. Two painted on the road and one little cardboard cutout, but no real burgers at all. <laughs> I gotta be more specific next time. <laughs> it's a really cool experience, but tough as. We tried. We tried. You tried. Did we try? We tried. We tried. We tried. I tried. You tried? I tried. Yeah. So good. Georgia tried. She tried. She tried. You tried.
Yeah, Sarah, Sarah, I tried. Sarah tried. Sarah, tried. Sarah, tried. <laughs> Sarah really tried. <laughs> yeah. She tried. really tried. She tried. Letizia tried. Want to climb? Yeah. Yeah, she tried. Yeah. So, yeah. we thought that we would like to get um, Alison Jackson that burger that she uh, really wanted. As committed team mates, we are going to go and get her a burger. Uh, so is Miss Jackson here? Yep. Uh, a double cheeseburger for your cheeseburger challenge. And it's still warm. <laughs> Sorry. This is all I wanted. <laughs> this is it. Bon appetit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ha <laughs> <laughs>